How's it going everybody? It's PM Dre back with another video and welcome to Sunday Lecture and today we're going to be talking about pause rep training. So what is it? It is what it sounds like. So it's a particular part in the exercise where you pause and then you proceed with finishing the exercise. So the best thing that I want to mention about this particular technique, it can be used by beginners, intermediate and advanced lifters. So let's first talk about the eccentric and the concentric part of movements. So the eccentric part of the movement, which we're going to use for an example, is the bench press. So the eccentric part is where the muscle is lengthening, where it's at its widest. So when we get up on that bench press, arms out, as you can see, my chest is lengthening. See, chest is wide. That is the eccentric part. So now the concentric is when the muscle is shortening. So I'm bringing it, bringing it, bringing it, bringing it. See, chest is now shorter. So now that we got that out the way, now we could talk about how I use it to my benefit. So I tend to use pause reps at the end of the eccentric part of the movement. So as I get down here, bam. So at this point, the bar is sitting on my chest. So as it's sitting on my chest, I take that brief pause, bring it all together, keep it all tight, bring it back up. So here's the first benefit I wanna talk about, is time under tension. Again, the more time you have under tension that you put on that muscle, the more stress that you put on it, again, this will incur more muscular damage. What does that mean? more gains, you can build more muscle, and on top of that, build strength. The second benefit that you get, it keeps you tight. So a good, this tends to happen a lot. I know you've seen it in the gym, maybe you do it yourself. So sometimes when you're on the bench, we call the technique touch and go. So as you're going down, you're doing this. It's very easy for momentum to jump in. Once momentum jumps in, again, that's when, you, you start getting like either you get some cheat reps or some of the times the reps are not even that clean or even sometimes you really, you really do not get a chance to really focus on the particular muscle you're working. In case an example for this one is the chest. A lot of people say, well, you know what? I feel a lot more in my tries and in my shoulders. Again, it's because of this particular technique. And then the third thing that I like to mention, it builds raw strength. Again, it is a lot more difficult to come from a dead stop to bring that weight back up as opposed to having the momentum that'll help you bring it back up again. So this is where it becomes very beneficial. Let's say for example, you, a lot of people have a sticking point on the bench. So as the bar is coming down, that tends to be the weaker part. Because a lot of times when people are re taking that bar off the rack, the problem is it just comes down like that right? There is no control whatsoever. So as you're bringing it down and you have it here, right? The first thing that's going on with your body is like, hey, we got to bring this thing back up. There's no momentum. So we got to use raw strength to bring that back up. So this is where I say it is great for beginners because at least they can start with a good foundation as far as activating the right muscle fibers and as much muscle fibers as possible. And the same goes for the other intermediates and advanced listers. If you really want to maximize your potential, you want to maximize your gains, you want to maximize your strength, maximize the amount of muscle you want to build, then pause reps are a great technique that you can use. And as far as any more benefits I can think of right now, which I almost forgot to mention, you also get to focus on building that mind-muscle connection. So that mind-muscle connection is so important. So at the end of that eccentric mo movement, again, it gives you that chance to kind of recollect and kind of say, okay, you know what? The focus is on the chest. We're at this dead stop, we got to get the bar up. So just think about it. Put, put, put your mind in your chest and just go, mm, and keep that tension on that chest and it will make a world of a difference. So I hope you guys found this video informative. So you know what we do here on the PM Dre Fitness Channel. Don't forget to share, that's right. Tell everybody that you know, yes you, you know I'm talking to you. Let them know that you watch your boy PM Dre Fitness. Like, that's right, like, comment, and subscribe. 
if you like this video and you want to see more, then subscribe to my channel and I'll catch y'all later. Thank <laughs> you.